The ultimate meal plan. Track your calorie burn so that you know your caloric budget, pre-planning all of your food in MyFitnessPal, weighing all your food so that you're making sure that you're getting all the portions and only eating what you weighed. Now that's the perfect ultimate meal plan. So as I said, the number one method of actually getting results and making it sustainable is by tracking your caloric burn. So how many calories in a day you're actually burning so that you can put yourself in a caloric budget. The caloric budget is, let's say you're burning 2000 calories, then what you wanna do is put yourself in a 500 caloric deficit every single day. So that amounts to about one pound of fat that you'll lose per week. Now it's not gonna happen all at once, but it is gonna happen after about four weeks of consistently being in that 500 caloric budget. So first we have to know how much you're burning in order for us to know how much we put you into a deficit. So if you're burning 2000 calories a day, at the end of the day, we put you at a 1500 caloric budget and then that'll give you that 500 caloric deficit and that'll be that one pound per week. The second thing that you need to do is pre-plan all of your food. If you have a plan, you're planning to win. So the night before, what you need to do is get your calories, get your macros from your coach, and then what you're gonna do is enter into MyFitnessPal everything that you plan to eat the next day. Now when it comes to the next day, you don't just like eat, let's say like Spartan stew. If you have Spartan stew already saved in your recipes, then you have to measure out one cup. If you just take a ladle and you just kind of free pour into the bowl, you could literally go from that 500 caloric deficit to no deficit. In fact, you might be in a surplus. So all of your food has to be tracked from what you've already planned the night before. And then you need to make sure, the last but not least, is that you're eating what you weighed. So if you have your one cup of Spartan stew and that's the last of your calories that you're allowed for the day, you cannot eat again. Like you cannot put another calorie into your mouth. Even if you get starving at night, if you get starving, then you have to make a readjustment, but this is not the video for that. If you set yourself up for 1500 calories and you've hit those 1500 calories for the day and in two hours later, you're hungry and you're like, well, you know, I can have another like half of chicken breast. Well, that half a chicken breast is about 125 calories. And guess what? You're 125 calories over your goal and that one pound per week now goes down to 0.8 pounds per week. And then you do this seven days a week, next thing you know, you're at a zero caloric deficit. So we have to make sure that we're only eating what we plan and only eating what we weighed. The second level is that you still track your caloric burn so you know what your budget is. You pre-plan all of your food in MyFitnessPal, but if you can't weigh all of your food, then you eyeball it and then you enter it and then only eat what you entered. So for instance, if you're already used to, let's say like the Spartan stew, and then you, somebody gives you a bowl, you look at the size of the bowl, your rough estimate, that's about a, you know, about a cup and a half. Then you go into MyFitnessPal and you plug in cup and a half of Spartan stew, then you eat it. Got that? The third level is that you still know what your caloric burn is, so you know what your budget is. Then if you're not weighing your food, you eyeball your food sizes, you enter into your tracker, but then you focus less on macros and focus more on caloric intake. So always staying under your caloric burn, okay? So as you eat it, you, you track it, you eat it, you have your budget, just make sure that you're staying under there. Disregard all macros, just stay under your caloric allowance. So guys, if you're not tracking and you're consistently gaining weight, then you're obviously doing the wrong thing. So you need to track so you know where your problem is and then you adjust along your way. So if you wanna focus on that ultimate perfect meal plan, you need to track your caloric burn so you know where your budget is. You need to pre-plan all of your food in MyFitnessPal so that you know that you're under that budget and you're hitting those perfect macros that your coach set up for you. You weigh all of your food before you eat it then you only eat what you've tracked that's within your caloric budget and with those perfect macros. Now, if you have no clue what I'm talking about or you're looking to get back on track or you're really looking to step it up this year, then send us an email north at fitclub.fit 
or go to our website, www.fitclub.fit, and send us a message inquiring about the Belly Burn Challenge, and we'll get you all set up today.